Hola, Nerd Fantastic. Hoy es martes. Do the intro. So this week at work, we're all shut down because it's supposed to be shut down week where we like do deep cleaning and get the building all nice and pretty and then we open up next week. And the director of your department is supposed to tell you what to do during shutdown week. Um, but as many of you already know, I'm the director of my own department. Yes! Higher education takes you places. However, there's no one in my department. So pretty much what I've been doing for the past two days is I've just been like hiding in my office, being busy, and not walking into the hallway. Because when I go into the hallway, people go, what are you cleaning? And I'm just like, mind your own business, peon. Yeah, when you invest over $100,000 into your brain, at some point it will eventually pay off. Boom! I didn't go to college for four years to wash the walls. So thus far, I'm still enjoying my job. It's, it's, it's kind of nice to have a job that you don't hate. I mean, it's, it's cool. And even when you like your job, though, there's still the underlying principle of the fact that you were at work, and work is work, and so you don't want to be at work, because being at work is kind of work, you know? I think that it was the, the poet and great thinker of the 20th century, lover boy, who got it right when he said... I'm going to write my state senators because I think that there needs to be a, a law that everywhere in America at 5 o'clock, they play that song on every radio station as you drive home. Because that would just be the greatest beginning to any weekend ever. Unless, of course, you work on the weekend, and then it would just make you incredibly angry and want to punch babies in the face. Speaking of people who punch babies in the face, vlog tag? Yeah, I still don't like you. All of you. Ever. I'm kind of hoping that right now, my facial expression is something of chagrin, because much to my chagrin, Amber has re-entered the world of the internet. And I'm chagrined to the max. Hey everyone, I bet that you've noticed that I figured out a new lighting situation to make my videos a little bit better. However, uh, it also helps me display this blemish that kind of looks like a tiny bruise that would have been created by the tiny angry fist of an ill-tempered elf who'd accidentally just got stepped on. I am not a shoe cobbler, elves. Stop coming to my house and fixing my shoes. I believe that you're in the wrong fairy tale. Um, this Tuesday video is completely out of control. Sarah Dodd, you're Wednesday, so I'll start with you. I think that your guitar skills have improved, even though that was actually in a video that was on Friday, but you're a Wednesday, and that kind of boggled my mind. Also, uh, we're going to be the greatest team for the Amazing Race ever. Team Nerd Fightastic for the win! Carmen and Cody, or Carmody, I did not um, get a chance to see your blog TV show. Did it go well? Did it not go well? Um, also, did you get that password situation figured out? Because that was really funny when you called me and asked me what the password to Blog TV was. That was really awesome. Casey, you weren't here, but I hope that you're doing awesome and your internet becomes, like, functional. Because that would be good to see you on a Friday. Or really, any day of the week. I wouldn't mind. Because you're awesome. Dave, your video was collage-tastic. Somehow that was so much cooler to say in my mind, but it was not cool at all. Liz, I didn't even recognize you in your video because there was no Wheezy Waiter or John Green or Alan Lestovka or Alex Day or Tom Milsom or Liz from Sister Salad or someone from Vlog Smoothie or someone from Vlog Tag or Abraham Lincoln or John Stamos. Hillary, I'm really excited that you're enjoying college and that you're having fun and that you're making friends and that you can fit six marshmallows in your mouth while still saying Chubby Bunny, even though the challenge was actually to say Nerd Fightastic, but Chubby Bunny, Nerd Fightastic, it's still about the same thing. Also, I'm totally going to beat that because I can fit way more than six marshmallows in my mouth because I'm that awesome. So, yeah. And Amber. I love you. Except that I don't because I actually hate you. Because you're an evil communist vampire. But I wrote you a love song. Yeah, try to follow that one. Beth, even though you're not part of our collab, you got to give me a challenge one time, and I have to say... Challenge pwned. But I'm not going to do the song, because it looks like I'm out of time. Oh, I'm sorry.